<laughs> you like this? It's nice and soft. It's nice, right? Yeah. Well, sometimes children like yourself or even younger, they get scared because something happened to their mom or dad. So we have things we can try to help make that kid feel comfortable and make him feel happy again. Especially when he's not feeling or she's not feeling all that well. So we carry teddy, teddy bears and some other stuffed animals that we can give some kids that make them feel better. Is that pretty cool? Yeah. Oh, it did? Yeah, my dog died last year. Yeah, our, our dog died like a year ago. This is not a care bear. They'll bring it up and be like, hey, I'm sorry. It's not a care bear. It's not a care bear. It's not a care bear. You know, my favorite care bear was Grumpy Jack. Yes, and me? I don't have any. We have a lot of teddy bears though, and a big trash bag. Do so you guys know how Ryan said sometimes we go on people that are in car accidents? So this, all of our fire engines have these tools, but this is the biggest <coughs> toolbox that drives around the city. This has a lot of special tools that help people when they're in times of need, okay? Sometimes when people get in a car accident, the car doesn't work normal, so it gets crunched or broken, and we got to cut it out to get the person out. These tools do just that. So these are big battery-operated scissors right here. So what this does, this allows us to cut into cars, Look. Make... That's oh, that's what those are. Those are the spreaders. These are the cutters. But this will cut through basically any car. We can cut a whole door off. We can cut a roof off. Can you cut this off? That's concrete. We have a tool that can cut concrete. Oh, that? Yeah, we can do that. Yeah. Here, bring your finger over. He said his finger. Oh, you like this? He said, can you cut this off? I think you were talking about your finger. Oh. Yeah, hey, you know what? Talk to your city council about that and tell them to replace this concrete. <laughs> <laughs> so, coming over here, guys. So, this is just some of the equipment. This will spread it open, this one, and that one cuts it. Over here, this box in here, and these back here are big airbags. You guys know what airbags are? No. Some yes, some no. They save you from like getting crushed. So, yeah, that's a type of airbag, yeah. So these airbags are lifting airbags. So these can help us lift up the car if we need to get something that's underneath it. So these can lift really, really heavy objects. Basically, wow, the semi-trucks can be lifted off the ground. Yeah, this? Yeah. Do you put the airbag under here. the car and fill it up and the car gets lifted up? <laughs> yeah. Who knows what these are? <laughs> there you go. There's the fireman. That's a good answer. These are different types of fire extinguishers. Have you guys ever seen any of this stuff? No. No? This is our magic medical equipment. This is what helps us save people when they're sick. It makes them all feel better. And this right here, we carry about a bunch of medications. It's a mini hospital right here. So we can fix them. You guys want to open it? So it's a suitcase full of medicines. So we have all these different types of medications that we can give people when they're sick. And then we can give them all this stuff to make them feel better before we get them to the hospital and the doctor sees them. And then they get better over time. Pretty interesting, right? This right here, this is our magic monitor. This shows us that everything's happening in your body. So we go, we, we take these on every call that we have and we go and... What's that? Sure, does someone want their blood pressure taken? Tristan, why don't you volunteer? No, I'll do it. All it does is just excite You guys have never had your blood pressure taken? There's no needle or anything. I have. I'll do it. I'll do it. Is it hurt? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, Who wants one? Who oh, wants to be the volunteer? Alright, come on. Oh, no, All right. So pull, pull your arms up. Your sleeves up. Pull your sleeves up. Let me put this on. You ready? You can swatch it. It's a danger. 
So look, sit still, don't try not to move around. So this squiggly line right here, we're all trained to read what this line means. So that tells us right now that he has a healthy, perfect heart. Exactly what we'd want to see someone his age. But sometimes that squiggly line means that someone's heart isn't doing well. And that's when we would give them these special medications to make it, what's your name? Tristan. To make it look like Tristan's perfect heart. So that's our goal is when we do that. Do you want to do the blood pressure? No! <laughs> <laughs> He's not very This, one, this one's super easy. Can I do it? We need one volunteer. Someone has to do it. All right. What's your name, buddy? All right, so you just relax. Let it hang on your side. No, just relax. Okay. Now it's just going to give your arm a hug, okay? And then see these numbers? This is going to give us a, it's called a blood pressure. And it's going to show how your heart's working. Is there a needle in it? There's no needle, no. It's just like a hug. Promise? I think you promise from here. No needle. Ah, there we go. I got one off. Yeah, no, take the other ones off. Oh, okay. Oh, you didn't get it. Hold on. Let's see. Oh, yep, you're still here. All right. I had that one. That's a full suit. I had those when I had surgery, but they were red Okay. Okay. Do you want to do I'll take that. What's that? 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 What's that?